Welcome to the Simple Object Motion Without Physics or Friction tutorial. Um, in this tutorial, we're going to learn how to move kind of basically like a spaceship type object and using the uh, arrow keys and have it move around the screen. Um, so if you haven't watched the uh, Object Motion template, which explains the setup, you'll probably want to do that now. So here's what we have. Okay, so we have an object on the screen. It's moving forward. If I hit the left arrow key, it turns 30 degrees and keeps moving forward. Okay. I can turn the right arrow key, does that, and I can push the up arrow which actually increases the speed. And so we're going to take a look at how to do that. Um, notice this is not how a spaceship would move uh, actually in space because uh, we have inertia and that sort of thing. That's coming up in a different uh, tutorial when we talk about physics. So let's close that for now and take a look at the code. Okay. So couple things. Uh, we have our player uh, class, which is a child of the turtle, turtle class, and it's got, it's been set up. I talk about that in the object motion template video, so take a look at that. When the player moves, okay, basically it's just going forward at whatever speed has been set here, and we're going to change the speed a little bit later. So basically that's, that's the default. And what we want it to do is when we push an arrow key, uh, we, the left arrow, of course, we want it to turn left, and it's going to turn left by 30 degrees. Uh, when we push the right arrow key, we want it to turn right by 30 degrees. When we push the up arrow, it's going to increase the speed by 1. So that's this speed is 1, so when the game starts, it has a speed of 1. If I push the up arrow once, I increase the speed to 2. If I push it again, to 3, and so forth. I can also decrease the speed. Uh, by pushing the down arrow, so plus and minus. Uh, to do that, what we do is we need to use the turtle listen method. That tells the turtle module to listen for the keyboard input. And then we use the on key method to tell the program what to do. So basically what this says is turtle on key. When I push the left arrow key, notice it's a capital L, this is what we use for it, I'm going to do player which is my player instance, and I want it to turn left. So since player is an instance of the player class, I go to the player class turn left method, and that will turn, so player becomes self, so player, player, player left 30. That's all. Same thing with right, up and down. Uh, well right goes right 30. Up just changes the speed, plus 1 or minus 1, in, in the case of decrease. And move is what actually moves it forward at that speed. Okay, so in our main game loop, we've got player.move, so that's here. So it goes forward at whatever speed and whatever angle that we've set down here. Let's take a quick look at that again. Okay, forward, left 30, left, 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 right, 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 and we can go faster. And that is the basics of moving that character or that object on the screen. Again, it's not physics based, it, that's not how things move in the real world, um, but it's good enough for uh, different types of games. So that is one method that we will work at. Stay tuned.